Well, I'm having the worst time trying to figure out the right uh, tool to get to cut on the turning part. So I'm going to switch my attention and try to get my six jaw chuck um, up and running. So, what I need to do is take this uh, back plate and get it turned so that everything works out. I'm using my four jaw chuck and you can see back here where the four jaw connects. It's only about or a quarter of an inch thick around there. But on this back plate that goes on the six, it comes with a lot more meat on it. So I have to take down or oh, a good half an inch of that cast iron off of there. And so I'm going to chuck that up and get her going. For those of you who are not familiar with cast iron, I heard uh, a couple of guys online talking about how messy it is and how abrasive. But guys, I'm here to tell you, <laughs> you professionals know this, but us novices, and cast iron is just like pouring dirt on your lathe. So I got um, a bunch of rags around here to try to catch the, the stuff off of here. If you don't, man, you're going to be cleaning forever. This is going to take a lot of cleanup, but holy cow, is that stuff nasty. Alright, I got to get that uh, back plate and that's showing about uh, 
two and eight hundred fifty two thousandths and then the chuck is showing about two eight thirty three so I'm going to keep track of it up there whittle away uh, at this to get it to fit into that Well, that's that machine surface there and it fits so time to put it onto the sixth jaw see if we can make this thing sing Well, I could see there's a, a wobble in this chuck, and uh, I'm looking down here at the register, and I didn't quite get that face to where the register was dead on. So, I got to take it back, the faceplate off, get it back in the fore jaw, and square that away. Well, there she is. I uh, took it off of there, redid the register. And uh, stuck this um, shaft in it. I know is pretty true. And uh, there's a little bit of run out on the end of it, so it's pretty good right now. Um, I have to learn how to really get your chucks um, trued up. But the good thing is, is now I got my six jaw and. I got my four jaw back since I got the uh, back plate out of there. Now I just got to clean up this lathe. Dude, like they say, man, I hear the guys on there talking about cast iron. Cast iron is like just taking dirt and sand and pouring it on your lathe, man. It is nasty to clean up. So I got a lot of cleanup to do, and uh, there's my six jaw. To give a little perspective, there's my orange belt. You can see it's turned gray. The dust gets up here, it's it's everywhere, it's just like it cuts dust. Um, gets on the floor. There's a thing I had on the saddle initially to keep it clean. So vacuuming, wiping down, and greasing it all to get all of this garbage off of it. Just kind of show how the, the belt gets black. You throw a little purple power on this belt and uh, cleans it right up and then I take the purple power and clean the pulleys there she goes and uh, clean this pulley up my whole lathe will be clean